up guys, it's a Joe at Midwest Invest. I'm a realtor here in Kansas City and uh, I just got to show my buddy Aaron a couple houses um, in Johnson County that he's looking for him and his fiance to live in. And now we're heading out, me and Kyle, we are heading out to Kansas City, Kansas to look at a couple potential rental properties. Uh, we got a duplex that we're going to first. Um, we'll give you the numbers when we get there. Uh, looks like a pretty good property. I think it's 112,000 or so. Um, near some of the properties I already have, so it's a good location. Uh, we'll give you the rest of the deeds when we get there. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Midwest Invest. My name is Joe. We're out here at a duplex here in Kansas City, Kansas. I'm a realtor and a real estate investor. We're taking a look at this duplex here, see if it makes sense for us to purchase or for any of my investor clients to purchase. So this property has been on the market for a little while now. Um, it's listed for I think 112. It was originally put, put on for 120 um, lower down. The power is on right now, so we don't have lights. But it's very small, very cheap, very basic duplex. This is the whole kitchen here. Missing the stove over there. Pretty small. That goes right out to the back porch. And then we got upstairs here. We go right into the bathroom. Once again, sorry about the lights. A uh, little tiny little bathroom. And then as we go down the hall here, go right into the living room. Very small once again. Everything has been painted, kind of remodeled, so it looks like it's pretty good. Doesn't need a lot of work. Um, this door goes right into the garage. Lights are off here, so it is dark. Um, but we got a hot water heater and a furnace in here. They both look pretty new um, within the last couple years old. So they don't look like they need to be messed with. Um, to go back in here, show you the two little bedrooms. And that's about it for the inside of this duplex. Uh, just fill off right here, about equal size duplex or uh, bedrooms, closets. Um, and you can kind of see out here into the little backyard, not much of it there. Uh, windows, I did notice, are really thin old windows, uh, so they're not very well insulated, but you kind of get what you pay for when you're buying an investment property for, you know, just over 100000 Um From what I see so far, um, we would probably probably not want to pay the 112 they're asking for, um, just because of the location and everything. This unit would probably get about maybe 700 bucks a month for rent um on the other side right now we're not gonna be able to get in there because it's rented out right now for 750 tenants are in there um if we decide to make an offer then we'll probably go and check out that side and see what it looks like but uh for now you know with total rents around 14 1500 um it's a pretty good deal if we can get it around 100,000, and, it, and it's pretty much turnkey uh, we did get a lot of snow the other day, so we do need to wait till the snow goes away so we can check out the roof, see how old that is. It does look like the gutters need a little bit of work, but for the most part inside, um, doesn't need a, doesn't need a ton of work inside. Um, we can hop right out here, um, show you the backyard real quick. So you kind of see you got a little porch here, um, left side right side of the duplex uh, this looks like this used to be a, a single family house um, that they transformed into a dupl duplex at some point because uh, this side has a two-car garage this side does not um, I think that's the only difference pretty much between the units they're about the same size otherwise um, so yeah we'll uh, we'll talk to the talk to the listing agent and the uh, owners of this property see if they're willing to negotiate we can offer them, you know, a cash offer of around a hundred thousand or a little less, and they'll take that. Then uh, it might be a property we we look at. Um, as long as the roof doesn't need any work, uh, we do need a new roof, then it probably wouldn't even be worth that. Maybe ninety-five thousand to a hundred thousand at max. So, um, all right, guys. Well, we'll we'll run the numbers on this one. We're gonna go check out a couple more properties today, uh, some single-family houses, uh, and we'll take a look at those, see if they make sense, and uh, go from there. All right, guys, so conclusion on this property, this duplex here in KCK. Um, overall, pretty good. It's something I would I would probably invest in. Um, it's something that someone that doesn't want to do a lot of work should definitely invest in. Um, the stuff I normally buy, 
typically has needs a little bit more work than this one this one looks pretty turnkey uh, maybe a little bit of maintenance stuff the gutters needed some work a um, few little things here and there but overall for a for a cheaper rental property it's pretty much rent ready ready to go um, typically I would buy a property maybe like this for 60 70 thousand put 15 grand into it you know it's and have a little bit of a discount on the property maybe have be all in for 90,000 instead of a hundred thousand or 85,000 instead of a hundred thousand uh, but if you don't want to do the work and you still want a good property that cash flows you know you're talking close to 1500 bucks a month in rent out of the two prop two units um, you know at a hundred thousand dollars with a mortgage payment you're talking 700 bucks 800 bucks a month you're gonna be cash flowing you know after expenses at least 400 but 500 bucks a month with a mortgage um, so for someone that wants to just buy property and not do any work, you know, put the key in, turn it, get a renter in there, and move on with their day with a good investment, this looks like a pretty good property. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed coming along with us today uh, on our adventure trying to find a rental property. Uh, we just checked out that one duplex today. We'll be on the search for more as soon as another one gets listed. We'll sure to be checking it out and making a video. Um, if you liked this video and enjoyed, you know, coming along with us, hope you hit that like button, subscribe to our channel so you can get uh, notifications when, when more videos get posted, hit that ring uh, notification bell, and um, yeah, if you uh, want to see us make other videos, um, you know, certain topics, put those in the comments below, and we'll try to read all those and, and make some videos that you might like. Uh, we got a bunch of new content coming out, I hope to see more videos about, you know, more rental properties house flips, um, what we're going to be doing personally in my real estate work slash house flipping rental property portfolio. Um, we'll make a video down the road of kind of what all I do and and uh, the rental properties that I own and manage and, and go into that a little bit more. But um, for now, hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time.